Hey guys, welcome to my channel. This is going to be an update of what I do to my natural hair since it has grown out. I, you guys have noticed I'm not cutting it at all. I have had moments where I've wanted to, but now I'm at this point of no return and I'm just not feeling the urge to do anything to it, but just let it grow. So I'm quite proud of myself. It's been uh, five years since I've been natural, and this is the first time I'm actually deciding to let it really grow. So let's see how far this will go, but um, just to give you guys an idea of what my maintenance is, since I'm trying to retain length every now and then, you guys will see that. I am wearing wigs. Um, I do wig reviews. I do hair reviews. So that's what's helping me to keep from cutting my hair. But not to mention, when I do wear my hair out, I bet you guys are wondering, what is Beauty Cut Right doing to it? <laughs> do I just go to bed and sleep on it the way it is? Or do I twist it every night? Well, here's the real, guys. There are moments where I just, yeah, I just go to sleep, get up. It's like flat to my head. And then I'll fluff it out in the morning and I'll just go. Um, I'm still able to do that at times. However, since it's pretty much longer and I just like it bigger, I find more often than not that I do twist my hair at night, every night, just about. Uh, so, I'm going to show you how I do that. Um, and I do it probably for about seven days and then I'll either wash my hair, deep condition it and put it back underneath a wig or, you know, wash, deep condition and restyle again and then I'll do this every night twist thing. So, let's get started. All right, so the products that I'm using to do my twist out that I do every night is the um, Daily Leave-In Conditioner by Talia Wajid. Um, happy I was able to find this at a local beauty supply store, but this was sent to me for review, and I have just been using it religiously on my hair and on my stepdaughter's hair. And I use this to spray all over my hair, and then I use the Manoy Oil from Talia Wajid as like to seal it just a little bit. So what I do, because it has like conditioner as in oils and just some awesome stuff that's in this bottle. And I spray it all over my head and I am not trying to soak my hair. I'm just trying to add some moisture even though it's pretty moisturized because I do this every day. <laughs> it is a daily leave-in um, conditioner spray. And so I'll do that. I won't rub it in until I have some manoil oil in my hand. So I make sure I have a nice generous amount. Rub it through and then I rub it through my entire head as much as I can. I have two combs in the side of my head that I need to take out. <laughs> but this is how I do it. And I focus it mostly on my ends. And yeah, this is my hair, guys. It's just getting longer and longer by the weeks and before uh it really kind of dries well it really doesn't dry as fast as it used to but before it dries i'll take large chunks of my hair and not twist it from root to tip i'll just take like midpoint my hair and i will twist it finger quill it at the end and I have a big like twist in my hair and I'll just pick large sections that you know I know my hair could work well with I don't use a comb I use my um, fingers and like kind of detangle it a little bit and stretch it and using my thumbs and my nails make sure you're not wearing rings uh, as you can tell, I don't have my wedding ring on, so this makes it a lot easier so that I don't snag my hair. And I just grab large pieces of it and just twist. So once I get to the front of my hair, I actually have like this bang that I leave out. And it's kind of dry by the time I get to it. I just spray my eye. 
<laughs> I make sure I put some more, you know, conditioner in it. I don't put any more oil in it. My hair has a uh, kind of a product buildup going on right now, so it'll be time to wash it because I have been doing this for seven days now. But um, in the front, I don't twist it. I flat twist it, if that makes sense. So in the front, because of the way I want my hair to hang in the front, it actually comes out better when I flat twist the front. And I try to flat twist the front pretty close uh, to my scalp as opposed to the rest of the twists, which are just like kind of midway my hair. But I prefer this so that when I... Um, take the twist out my hair falls here without the separation that goes on so this is how I do the front of my head once I have all of my twists as you can see I have them all in what I'll do is I'll go back and I will feel for any that I feel are too fat and the reason why I do that is because if they're too fat, that means I won't get a good enough definition on my ends. So I would separate them, like this one was too fat, and then I would re-twist them into two separate twists. So again, just for definition purposes, if it feels too fat, like I won't get any good definition on the ends, I'll separate it and twist them into two separate twists. All right, guys, so I'm all done. I've gotten a chance to separate all the ones that were too thick. So what I do is my last, like, spritz. And just leave it. And I tie it up at night. Now, what I use... To tie my hair up at night is like the shea butter and olive oil treated uh, bonnet. And it is an extra large so that it's comfortable in my head. I don't want anything tight when I'm going to sleep. So this is what um, I have. It's from Too Fit. That's the brand. But um, you can go, to, you can find these at any beauty supply store. You seriously can. So that's what I have. And here it is. All I do is put it over my head because I have more hair now and I just go to bed just like this. I don't know. Never thought bonnets were all that cute either. <laughs> but yeah, that's it. So that's how I twist my hair every night. Very simple. Very easy. Um, and I like doing it this way because I like to do it like somewhat dry because my hair is stretched at this point. So, um, and that's one of the reasons why I twist every night and it gives me the big hair that I, uh, want. So it'll keep me from cutting my hair. So, uh, I'll see you guys in the next class. Thank you.